Dengue, or breakbone fever, is a viral infection that spreads from the Aedes aegypti, or yellow fever mosquito, to people, which can also spread chikungunya, Zika fever, Mayaro, and yellow fever viruses. Acting Chief Medical Officer in the Ministry of Health, Dr. Sean Charles says the prevention and control of dengue is the most important element in addressing the dengue outbreak. You must understand that these mosquitoes can breed in anything that can hold water, including discarded tires, tin cans, bottles, floor pots, storage jars, cooling systems, drains, and there are some um, ornamental plants that can whole um, small quantities of water as well. These must be examined and they must be um, eliminated. These mosquitoes can, can inhabit many different settings, such as homes, schools, businesses, healthcare facilities, and they like shaded areas of these facilities as well. We encourage everyone to just spend a little time, um, at least once a week, examine your, surro your surroundings for sites where mos mosquitoes can breed. Dr. Charles issued this plea after presenting an update of the epidemiology data during a press conference on Friday. In Epi Week 19, a total of 39 cases were recorded with 10 individuals hospitalized. 60% of the hospitalized cases were from the parish of St. Andrew. The parishes of St. Patrick, St. Mark, St. John, and St. David each had 10% um, of the hospitalized cases. The data shows an increase in the number of dengue cases by 19 and in the number of hospitalizations by 7 compared to the 20 dengue cases recorded in week 18, which included three hospitalizations. The age group, the single age group that, that was most affected were the 25 to 44 years um, age group. However, we note that 56% of the reported cases were ages 24 years and below, or 24 years and younger. He notes that treatment of dengue is based on the presenting symptoms and advised against self-treatment using over-the-counter drugs such as ibuprofen, motrin, and aspirin. Now, these medications such as the, um, the, the ibuprofen and the aspirin and so on, they tend to inhibit your platelets, all right? So um, they will basically worsen the situation. And aspirin, in addition, can cause another severe complication, especially in, in young children. So that is why the, the public is advised to stay away from these medications. According to Dr. Charles, mosquitoes are most active during the day and encourages persons to keep their bodies covered as much as possible. He further encouraged the use of mosquito nets, insect repellents, door and window screens as added mitigative measures. For GBN News, I'm Nisha Paul.